hadith about the Mahdi as well is the hadith reported also in the Sunan of Abu Dawood that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, Al Mahdi minni. The Mahdi is from my children, my progeny. And his forehead shall be large and wide and his nose will be aquiline. So the nose is not going to be a flat nose. It's going to be an aquiline, a sharp nose. And the forehead will be larger. So in other words, like you, you know, some people they have a large forehead. So this Mahdi will have a large forehead. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Al Mahdi minna ahl al bayt. The Mahdi is from us ahl al bayt. Yuslihuhu Allahu fi layla. Allah will rectify him and make him righteous in one night. What does this mean? Our scholars mention that this means the Mahdi will grow up and people will not assume that he is a very religious person. He might be an average Muslim, maybe, maybe even below average. But something will happen and in one night the Mahdi will become a righteous person. And this gives hope to all of us who are sinful. That if even the Mahdi will start off at a low level, and something will trigger and tawbah will take place, and the Mahdi will repent and become such a righteous person. So even the Mahdi, his lifestyle at the beginning of his life will not be at the end of his life. The Prophet ﷺ said, Allah will change him and correct him in one night. Correcting means he was incorrect. Salih means he was not salih before that night. So this is a bashara for us who are all sinners, that Allah can change anyone from anything. Some of the Sahaba used to do very evil things, then Allah guided them to Islam, and look what happened after that. So we should not look at the past, rather we should look at the future. Of the things that we learn about the Mahdi as well, and this is something that should give us pause for thought in the time frame that we live in, is that the hadith mentioned, hadith is in Abu Dawood, that the Prophet wasallam said, the earth will be full of injustice. The earth will be full of injustice and tyranny. And the Mahdi will come and fill it with justice and with truth. Which means the world will be a very, very depressing place before the Mahdi. The earth will be full of injustice. And if you look at what is going on now, Allahu Musta'an. But we are, it looks like in that direction now, from bad to worse, from bad to worse. The world is getting worse and worse and worse. A time will come when the world will be full of injustice. The world will be dark and bleak and black. And in that darkness, Allah will send a light for the ummah. In that darkness, when it looks like there is no hope, Allah Azza wa Jal will send someone who will unite the Muslims and will then change the situation of the earth from injustice back into uh, justice. So this is one of the beautiful predictions that terrifies us but also gives us comfort. That you know, it will get bad, but after it gets bad, inshallah it will be.